Hey folks, a warm one across the valley. Temperatures are in the 80s tonight, and the next few days are going to be just like this. You watch your day planner for tomorrow, and we're up to 100 degrees middle of the afternoon, and that's an average. Western part of the valley will be hotter than that. Eastern part of the valley a little bit cooler, and even into tomorrow evening, we're still 82 degrees by 10 o'clock. Rest of Texas tonight, only 73 in Abilene. It rained there. Got some strong thunderstorms coming through that part of Texas, but everybody else is just hot, hot, hot. There's the thunderstorms. Watch out. It's quiet for a while. Then here comes this line of of course, that line is not going to get anywhere near us. We're just going to stay hot, hot, hot until something changes. Now, what can change it? Well, perhaps the tropics. We're keeping an eye on the system that's trying to develop. Right now, nothing to it. And that's why it's difficult to track it, because you can have something to track. And there's no center, there's no circulation, no center of anything. But the Hurricane Center says it has a 50% chance of developing something out to five days. Nothing in the next two days, but out to five days, there's a decent shot. And you're talking somewhere over the Yucatan Peninsula, probably late in the weekend. So we're not going to see anything different until probably at least Sunday, maybe Monday. Now, this is what it again looks like. Let's look at the European model. We showed you the GFS, the U.S. model, last half hour, and it showed the thing getting into the western Gulf and then just going away. And some of the models take it northeastward. One of the models takes it northeastward. Here's the European. Saturday, you start to see the stuff trying to get going into Sunday, into Monday. Finally, you've got a low pressure area. And then the European says, oh, it's going to go westward and then westward and then maybe northwestward. This is one model. Remember, we showed you another one that had it sitting out here and just kind of fading away. So that's what we're going to be watching for over the course of the next few days. Rainfall wise, again, this is the European. It suggests by the time we get to the middle of next week, not until then, but by the middle of next week, pretty good chance of rain possible. Some of it could be heavy, so we're going to have to watch for that into next week. So for tonight, 80 for a low, partly cloudy, warm and muggy. Tomorrow, back up to 100, mainly sunny. It'll be a hot one. Southeast winds at 12 to 22. Next three days, you're looking at a couple of near 100. Then it comes down by the end of next week, a little bit cooler with a chance for a shower or thunderstorm. That's your updated for Storm 5 forecast.